Okay guys, so what we're going to do today is we're going to open up the Parrot Free Flight 6 app. Now this app is so new that it's not even in the App Store yet. Um, so we're beta testing. So that's pretty exciting. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to click Controller because we're using the controller, we're not using the phone. Um, the Parrot and Afi can um, be used with uh, a cell phone without the controller and it can be used with the controller so we're gonna click on controller and move on to the next screen um, now we're gonna connect a wire to the controller from the controller to the smartphone so we're gonna use just the charging cable that came with um, my iPhone X and we're gonna plug it in and then there's a, a USB A on the back of the controller that we're plugging it in um, and then the next step is we're going to turn on the drone so you just give it a tap um, I tried to hold it down or double click so you just push the button down so now the drone is going to go through its calibration it's going to calibrate the gimbal and the propellers and then you're going to just wait to see um, when the screen changes on the phone once the screen changes on the phone then um, it's paired up um, and we're ready to download um, firmware updates so I'm gonna speed up this process um, the overall process took about 10 minutes um, but we're gonna speed it up for you because you're really just looking at a screen <laughs> with a loading loading circle so um, I really like the looks of the app um, as a UX designer um, I notice um, kind of layouts of applications and where the submit button is and whether it's user friendly um, so this whole process um, was really nice um, so basically um, what you're seeing on the screen is the first thing we did was we upgraded the controller upgraded the firmware on the controller um, and then we went through two cycles of um, upgrading the firmware on the drone itself um, so as you can see it says one of two um, and now this is two of two. Um, so basically what this has to do is it has to download the firmware and then install the package. Now whenever it does one of two and then two of two um, there might be two installments that have to be installed in order. Um, so if I had the drone yesterday I might have only um, performed one firmware update so now we're going to go to the next screen now we're going to actually comp, um, calibrate the drone itself um, and this is just about every drone you get um, has some sort of calibration process but basically what you're doing is you're um, moving all of the um, accelerometers and gyroscopes you're kind of just level setting them um, putting them back to normal um, so and the reason I'm doing this in the studio, guys, is because uh, there's nothing more frustrating than getting out to the field with your new toy um, ready to fly, and then you have to go spend 10 minutes upgrading the firmware, and your battery life will probably get, go down to 90%. So I hope this video was helpful for you guys. Um, please like, subscribe to my channel, and uh, stay tuned for more videos on the Paradonafi. Peace out, guys.